Well, when I heard the news, it was a real surprise to me and, and a great honor uh, because uh, this is the first uh, international award I am receiving on uh, the vaccine and uh, business part of it. it. Others have been for my work in horse racing. Celebrating Asian excellence, which is the, the, the tagline of this uh, the event, what do you make of that and what does that mean to you? Well, it means a more international recognition of the contribution I've made in in the field of entrepreneurship and philanthropy. And do you think the community watching the Asian Awards will be moved by the achievements of what they've seen here today? I don't know. That's for them to decide. The only thing I'm proud about is that I've saved uh, millions of children's lives, which have otherwise been lost because of me giving vaccines at the price of a cup of tea. You've witnessed other people receiving awards here tonight. Has there been a highlight that you'd like to talk about? Oh, well, I was thinking about uh, the time when I'd have to come and make my speech, so I, I, I wouldn't be able to tell you exactly which uh, uh, event uh, struck me most, but I think the one that touched my heart most was the gentleman who worked and suffered for so many years with Nelson Mandela. And finally, if you had a message for the organizers of the Asian Wars, what would that be? Well, a business leader of the year came to me even though I didn't look at the business as a profit-making organization. I did it with a philanthropic outlook and with a very low uh, cost margin. But the result was that all my competitors vanished. That's how I became business leader of the year in vaccines. The Video Hub.